He's the best hard preacher all round hard preacher in the game. Up next is Amaru. Man, we're going from greatness to absolute devastation. I, I, I'm honestly considering F tier. <laughs> it's either F or D. I might, I might go D just because the G8 A1 is such a good assault rifle and the supernova is such a good shotgun. So, so few opportunities when you can use that Garahug to your advantage. Very few opportunities. Unless you're going way outside the objective and it's like a second floor objective and you're able to rush like that, sure. But at that point, why even risk using the hook in the first place? Just use Ash and rush from somewhere else. And it's just nine times out of ten. It's not worth it to use this Amaru hook, because if you use it in the objective, you are 100% going to die, because somebody's going to hear that loud-ass hook coming through the window. So, yeah, the E-tier operator, I'm only putting her up above F, because she's got good weapons. Speaking of good weapons, we've got Ash. She recently got slightly nerfed, the R4C, recently going from a 30 round magazine to a 25 round magazine but bro it's still a great great operator with a great great gun i'm throwing her into s bro she's still so so good if you're looking for a good gun a good ability with a fast operator she's still one of the best in my books for uh for all round utility her ash breaching rounds are just most, you know, utility in the game, and you can open walls with them so, so good. She's still 100% going into S tier for me. Great operator. Oh man, we are just going from highs to lows because up next is Blackbeard, and that's an easy F tier. Don't play Blackbeard, guys. Just don't play Blackbeard. I still see every now and then, very rarely, but every now and then people running the sky in ranked, and unless you want to literally use the slowest operator in the game with mid-tier weapons. Just don't use him. I really hope they rework this guy sometime soon because, bro, he is just, he used to be easily, when he first came out, he was easily the most, one of the most broken operators in the game. His shield had, I think it was like 1500 health or something, and it basically, you couldn't destroy the shield was basically indestructible unless you pumped the whole magazine into it but nowadays the, the shield is more like um it's it's literally like a piece of saran wrap you put it in front and it breaks in one shot it's pretty terrible so yeah and uh if, if you had better guns it would maybe make up for it but the mk17 it's not very it's okay but it's not very good low rate of fire yeah, just not worth it. Don't use Blackbeard. Blitz, on the other hand, okay. I feel like this was like a couple years ago. I would totally rate Blitz, maybe a B or a C, but I really think he's at least a B, at the very least. I've really been warming up to Blitz lately. I know better players are like maybe going to be able to deal with him a little bit better, but he is so fun to use, and if you've got a coordinated team that you can especially in objectives that are a little more, you know, claustrophobic at times. He can really punish defenders that are not expecting a blitz rush. Trust me, if you're not a shield guy, give him a try at some point. He's very, very fun. Brava, another really fun operator at times. I feel like she's another, maybe, I'm going to give her B tier, honestly. Very fun operator. The para 308 that she uses is okay. It's, you know, it's not the craziest weapon, but, bro, her hacking drones, the clutch drones, are so, so good at times for denying things like a Malusi, you know, a Fenrir, um, you know, a bunch of other stuff, just hacking enemy equipment, and 
guess one of the better attackers for dealing with utility, dealing with, um, you know, just great for getting intel as well. Those explosive drones aren't just good for dealing with utility, they're great for getting intel. And for that, I'm doing S. He is well-rounded, has flashes, claymores, I believe his uh, option between flashes and claymores are just always good, plus a great gun in the air, 33, and a great ability.
next show.